Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today will be my weekly grocery haul. I missed my grocery haul last week. It was a bit of a small one. This one is a bit small too, but um, I don't know. I guess lately, since I've been trying to eat what's in my pantry and just kind of supplement with things I may need, since I am moving next month, I'm really trying to get everything out of my kitchen. So this haul included sprouts which is on this side and then trader joe's on that side so we'll start off with sprouts since it's here i just got some organic bananas and then i got two avocados i got three of the ambrosia i guess they're gold apples i've i don't know if they're different i've always known them to just be ambrosia so who knows i wonder if they taste different i got two of these el pato salsas these are really good for enchiladas or chilaquiles if you guys like that definitely try this it definitely needs salt but the flavor is really good i don't like basic enchilada sauce so if i don't make my own then that's pretty much the only sauce i like to use i got some of this siggy's strawberry gogurt ones these are actually really good and they don't come with all that extra bad things in there um, my son surprisingly liked them so i'm excited um i got this siggy's raspberry this is like the drinkable type of yogurt i wanted to try this because i normally just stick to strawberry or vanilla so we'll see how that goes and then i got some 100 grass-fed beef again i love their beef it was really inexpensive 2.99 a pound for grass-fed really good um i'm trying to think i'm actually making hamburgers today so Usually when I get this, it's just for hamburgers. Um, let's see. I wanted to try the coconut flavor of the Siggy since I do love the yogurt myself. Um, I'm excited to try coconut flavor. I've yet to find a good coconut flavored one that, um, yeah, tastes good. Then I got some zucchini just to pair as a side with some salmon that I'm going to have this week. And then I'll head over here to Trader Joe's. Back here, I got some of the wood-fired, uncured pepperoni pizza. I got this panko breaded tilapia fillets. That one is so delicious. I love to just have it with a side of fries or anything and just add hot sauce on top of it. The pizza, I think I've tried it once. It wasn't bad. I think I needed to cook it more, but I wanted to try it again. Then this one, I've never tried. It looked really good. I saw somebody haul this. It's a French-style flatbread with ham, caramelized onions, and Gruyere cheese. So it looks really good. Um, never tried it before. These I have tried. I got two of the beef steak burritos. They are really, really good to supplement when you don't know what to cook, but you want that um, takeout type of flavor. It is not bad. Also, these cheese enchiladas, it's kind of a, a given that I always get those. I got these peanut butter filled pretzels. I have never had these before. I'm not the pretzel person in the family. My son is, so hopefully he likes these. I got some organic corn chip dippers. I got two of these um, peppermint toothpaste. It has a couple things um, that I was interested in, or it doesn't have a couple things that the other toothpastes have and so i wanted to try this one i think i've tried it before the flavor is not sweet which is fine with me because i don't need any sugar in my toothpaste um then i got this pub cheese i've had the regular cheddar cheese but this one is cheddar with jalapenos so i thought i'd get this for my husband and um these as well i've never tried these are the mini beef tacos i saw somebody talk about them in their haul and say they're really good i think they got the chicken ones but i wanted to try out the beef ones so then i got the social snackers to go with the dip i got a two pack or two pounds of strawberries i got some sliced white mushrooms some shredded green cabbage I got a cucumber back there and then some green onions. I got some mild cheddar cheese, hamburger buns to make hamburgers. So that's pretty much it for the haul for this week. Again, I'm just kind of getting what I need. And honestly, even when I move, I hope to just kind of get what I need and not get things that are just going to stay in my pantry. And hopefully one day I eat them. I want to eat everything I buy. So I think... So it's kind of like a little experiment for me as well. 
So I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.